Princess Charlotte's incredible similarity to Kate in royal visit composure. The young royals Charlotte and George are often seen together with their younger sibling Prince Louis in royal engagements, such as the king's coronation and trooping the color. George, nine, was more accustomed to royal duties and appearances even at young age. But Charlotte, eight, holds herself different in public to her older brother. OK reports historian, writer and broadcaster, Tessa Dunlop, recognized the princess appeared comfortable at royal engagements. She said, Charlotte seems quite composed, she looks out for her little brother, she's very photogenic and in many ways more relaxed than George. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Tessa added, this is quite normal for girls. She's still quite young, it's quite cleverly choreographed, I think we believe we see a lot more of Charlotte than we really do. From the sort of camera angles, the photographs, to her little appearance wearing a matching headpiece with her mother at the coronation. The royal expert compared Charlotte and her mum Kate, who has always been very composed. She said, Kate is not a foul, she knows they've got a whole life ahead of them. It's just slowly and incrementally upping exposure but very much on their terms and quite choreographed. Regarding George preparing to become king one day, Tessa said, the whole thing is a learning process, that's the point. The exposure to the press is one of the hardest things and if you have it earlier I think it's easier to handle. We know that from Philip, he never got used to it, compared to Elizabeth who was born into it. The three young royals, George, Charlotte, and Louis, are expected to ride in a carriage this weekend with Kate during their grandfather's official birthday celebrations at Trooping the Color. Tessa added that seeing the children in the carriage can often feel like a Disney moment alongside the military vans and thousands of troops who line the streets of London. The Mirror reported earlier that Princess Charlotte already has a pretty sophisticated palette, according to her mother Princess Kate. Her tastes in food are seemingly already pretty cultivated, and Kate gave the game away on her daughter's go-to snack while she was visiting a primary school in North London in 2019 at the age of three. When Kate visited the Lavender Primary School, she revealed that Charlotte loves olives while she was there. While most kids are likely to turn their nose up at some adults' favorite snacks, instead preferring often anything that comes in a colorful package or tastes nice and sweet, this young royal's snack of choice is decidedly grown up. The Prince of Wales is an usher at the ceremony at Chester Cathedral, which will see the Duke, whose real name is Hugh Grosvenor, marry his fiancée Olivia Henson. William has a close friendship with Hugh and he and wife Kate picked him to be one of the godparents for their eldest son, Prince George. However, William made a solo appearance at the nuptials today as Kate is still recovering following her cancer diagnosis earlier this year, and her subsequent preventative chemotherapy treatment. George also didn't make an appearance at the wedding of his godfather, and this is likely due to being down to the fact the wedding is taking place on a weekday during term time and the young prince will be at school. Also missing from the wedding today is Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, despite Harry also being close to the Duke, who is godfather to Prince Archie. With William and Harry embroiled in a bitter rift with relations, said to be at rock bottom, the Sussexes appear to have made the decision to stay away from the nuptials to not let the feud overshadow his pal's big day. According to the Times, Harry was invited to Hugh's wedding, but then over a phone call with the groom agreed to stay away in what is described as a civilized understanding. This move in turn cleared the way for William to perform his job as usher at the ceremony.